Most efficient way to reverse a NumPy array. Believe it or not, after profiling my current code, the repetitive operation of NumPy array reversion ate a giant chunk of the running time. What I have right now is the common view based method. Is there any other way to do it more efficiently, or is it just an illusion from my obsession with unrealistic NumPy performance? gives a reversed view into the original array R. Any changes made to the original array R will also be immediately visible in reversed underscore R. The underlying data buffers for R and reversed underscore R are shared, so creating this view is always instantaneous, and does not require any additional memory allocation or copying for the array contents. See also, this discussion on NumPy views, how do I create a view onto a NumPy array? Possible solutions to performance problems regarding views. Are you recreating the view more often than you need to? You should be able to do something like this. I'm not a NumPy expert but this seems like it would be the fastest way to do things in NumPy. If this is what you are already doing, I don't think you can improve on it. Only creates a view, so it's a constant time operation, and as such doesn't take longer as the array grows. If you need the array to be contiguous, for example because you're performing many vector operations with it, as contiguous array is about as fast as flippud slash flipro. Code to generate the plot. Because this seems to not be marked as answered yet. The answer of Thomas Aroldson should be the proper one, just use. If it is a 1D array, column array. With matrices do. If you want to reverse rows and flip ad matrix if you want to flip columns. No need for making your 1D column array a two-dimensional row array, matrix with one none layer, and then flipping it. np.flip or flips the array left to right. Note that for 1D arrays, you need to trick it a bit.